Hi there, I'm Mr. Shamlan, consultant hand surgeon. And I'd like to talk to you about lumps around the hand and wrist. The hand and wrist lumps are usually benign and there are a few causes, but a few common causes. And the most common cause of lumps is, are ganglions and there are soft tissue swelling that comes from the joint itself. The joint is, um, has a lubricant fluid and occasionally this breaks through the capsule, which is the baggy sheet around a joint, and it forms a lump at either the back of the wrist, sometimes the front of the wrist, but essentially any joint, so you can get it around the fingers. Other common places are just in the base of where the tendon runs and has a little sheath, and you can have a little ganglion here that looks like a pearl, called a pearl ganglion. Ganglions tend to come and go, and they are, as I said, benign. So as a whole, we tend not to offer treatment because some go of their own accord. Occasionally we aspirate, which is we put a small needle into the lump, perhaps with some local anesthesia, and just remove the fluid. I would say the outcome for ganglions following aspiration is pretty good, because 50% of them tend to disappear. And as I said, they can go off their own accord anyway, or at least sometimes it decreases the size. So pain and function are the main reasons we offer any treatment for ganglions. And I would say if patients don't have any pain or functional problems, they can have it for as many years as they want really. And after a period of time, if it does become painful due to the local pressure effects, then we can talk about surgical treatment. Surgical treatment broadly is depending on where they are. If it's around the wrist, we can use through keyhole surgery, we can actually find the stalk of where the ganglion comes from and just shave the stalk through the um, ones in the front of the finger or around other joints, sometimes you have to make a small incision. Most of the surgery can be done under local anesthesia or certainly day surgery with um, a pretty good recovery rate. There's no real immobilization after the surgery, so you're able to move your hand straight away and use the hand as long as the wound heals in the week or two preceding the surgery. Other lumps around the hand um, could be related to the, the structures in the hand itself. So superficially in the skin, you can get small sebaceous cysts, you can get lumps coming from uh, the, the, the skin, such as Dupuytren's disease, which forms fibrous lumps in the hand. Um, arthritic lumps, which come from the actual joint itself. There is a tumour, um, which is a growth called a giant cell tumour, which is very common but benign also, um, which can be around a tendon or a sheath of a tendon. And that, once again, is a slow growing but, but can be quite a common lump. So the take home message for hand lumps generally are, most are benign, um, most will resolve um, after a period of time and if they don't resolve but they're not painful and they're not progressing and they're not causing any functional problems, they don't need specifically any treatment. But obviously any advice we're happy to give um, and certainly see your general practitioner if you have any concerns.